Inside top 25, uh, as we make our way toward the top of that list, we're at 16 through 20. This is my 16 through 20, America. All right, America. Where, where is it? Oh, he's got Marcus All at 16. Isaiah Thomas, DeAndre Jordan, Blake Griffin, and Damian Lillard. It's hard to judge. Blake Griffin's all the way down at 19. I'm not mad at that list except for one player. Where's one? Blake Griffin? I ain't going to say no names. DeAndre? No. Well, well you guess, Ernie. Say so. Well, we oh. are. But, okay. Uh, Isaiah Marcus Thomas. Marcus No. Nope. Uh, DeAndre Jordan. No. Uh, Blake Damian Griffin. Lillard. No. Damian uh, we no. said every name. No, you did. This week's Kyrie Irving okay. at 25. Top Marcus right. Aldridge at 25. Top right. I don't know about Gordon Hayward. Yeah. Gordon Hayward. Not top 25. You, top, yeah, top you top have 50. Gordon Hayward. You, wait, but you also have Isaiah Thomas over um, Kyrie. Top 50, but not top 25. Uh, I, you like, you like you all like those Isaiah? guys are right the same. Uh, Kyrie's probably a better player, but if you put Gordon Hayward with LeBron and Kevin Love, it'd be different. If. Let me ask you a question. And I like Kyrie, but I'm making this point. How great was he in Cleveland before LeBron got there? Well, he was in his second year one, first no, but, year uh, they, it, it, they won like 15 games I, I'm a not year. saying. I just, I'm I just said making a point. Tonight. Gordon Hayward I think he's going to be the MVP in two years. Uh, you think uh, he could be. He's a hell of a player. But I'm saying, you guys, I'm factoring in how good guys who play with. Kyrie's a hell of a player, but he was winning 15 games before LeBron got there. I have, I have a question to ask yes, you. Yes, sir. Because I don't know if this guy's going to be on anybody's list, but he's going to be on the list. And B. He's not on my list. Right, uh, not yet, but where will he end up? If Joel, uh, I told you, want uh, to give Because a it's too early. Want to give a shout out to Brian Colangelo and Brett Brown gave me and the great Billy Cunningham, who's been a great friend and coach for me for a long time. He invited us to watch the 76 scrimmage before they went to training camp. And we left there that day saying, wow, this kid, Embiid, and Ben Simmons, are going to dominate the league in the next three to five years. If those guys can stay healthy, I saw MB play Kenny. He was shooting threes. He was doing the stuff on the block like Elijah Wan. That's disrespectful to Elijah <laughs> Yeah, exactly. But this He's is doing him. good stuff on the yeah, Thank yeah, you. Yeah. But let me tell you something. If him and Embiid and Simmons can stay healthy, the Sixers are going to be a perennial contender start in three years and have a 10-year window if both of those guys stay healthy. Okay. Well, it's a bold prediction for Bold. I Dude, Embiid, real. Yeah. Well, we'll wow. see if you're around here. We, we, we are all right. He's all right. He ain't real. I just want to be able to see Wait. you. He Wait, all right. hold on a second. He's all right. What do you mean he's all right? You, do you have to hate on every big man? No, I don't. I don't hate on I said he's all right.